Let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit better. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the U.S. Good series of strikes for him there. Staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Oh! Gustafson gets up against here, but he looks hurt. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Oh, how about the hand speed of Alexander Gustafson in terms of the... Oh! Huge right hand! Back to the feet! Who's hurt? Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. So one minute into the fight, we've got a full-on brawl here, DC. It's great for the fans, not necessarily for the gas tank if this thing goes much longer. Not great for the gas tank and not good for the old noggin. You can't take so many upside the head. Somebody's going to sleep. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, you 